And Royals fans continue to look for ways to honor the memory of Jordana Ventura. KCTV5's Nathan Vickers is live now at Kauffman Stadium, a place where so many have gone to mourn. Nathan. Well, fans keep coming in and out, and this memorial just keeps growing and growing. But Kauffman Stadium is not the only place that fans are gathering to mourn. Across town at Empanada Madness on Southwest Boulevard, it's a favorite place of uh, Royals players, including Gordano Ventura. The restaurant asked reporters to stay outside today, but the restaurant published a tribute to him on its Facebook page. Many fans, like the Melpolder family, wanted to eat at the South American Eatery just to show their support for a place Ventura enjoyed in Kansas City. Well, I think it was it was not quite of a li as lively of an atmosphere as you typically have. It's I don't know if somber is the right word, but I think everybody's uh, kind of sad and disappointed. I, uh, I I like this place, and we were just kind of kicking the ideas around. And I said, let's come to Empanada Madness to show our support. I don't know. It's just it's sad. It's a tragic loss. And at KCTV 5 News at 6, we'll hear from more fans who are struggling to cope with some of the rumors surrounding Ventura's death. Reporting live from Kauffman Stadium, Nathan Vickers, KCTV 5 News. Yeah, a lot of that investigation still underway there in the Dominican Republic surrounding what exactly happened to your Donna Ventura. Nathan, thank you. And we will have more on today's funeral coming up right here at 6 o'clock. And our Royals coverage will continue all week going into Royals Fan Fest. That's Friday and Saturday at Bartle Hall. KCTV 5 will have live reports throughout Fan Fest, including events honoring Ventura. We'll hear from Royals players and manager Ned Yost. That's Friday and also Saturday. There